Consider the following situation. The Australian US denominated 10 year government bond yield is equal to 8.3%. 10 year treasury US bond is equal to 5.2%. Annualized standard deviation of the Australian stock index is equal to 35%. Annualized standard deviation of Australian US denominated 10 year government bond is equal to 25%. The country risk premium is closest to now the country risk premium is specified as the risk spread which is equal to the Australian US denominated 10 year government bond yield that is 8.3% minus 10 year US Treasury bond yield that is equal to 5.2% into the annualized standard deviation of the Australian stock index that is 35% divided by the annualized standard deviation of Australian US de dollar denominated 10 year government bond that is 25%. So in this case it will give me the value of 3.434%. So option A is the correct option. Now the value of this risk spread is is equal to the value of the government bond denominated in US dollars for a country minus the the bond issued by the US Treasury of the same maturity. So in this case the risk spread is equal to 8.3% minus 5.2% and we have to multiply it by the ratio of the annualized standard deviation of the Australian stock index that is the stock index of the home country divided by the annualized standard deviation of the Australian 10 year government bond which is denominated in US dollars. So in this case the answer will be 4.35 percent.